Don Jones's fiance of nine years, Jesse Moses, is no longer with the former UFC light heavyweight champion and Hall of Famer. My fiance left me about two months ago today. She finalized she won't be coming back. If you're a John Jones hater, have a toast. I feel like sh Jones and Moses have three kids together and have been with each other for around 20 years. They were high school sweethearts and a popular couple as shown in this function where Jones won the honor of being the snowball king. The Eagle FC Lee vs. Sanchez card on March 11th has added some more fights with USC fighters such as Ray Borg who fought for the flyweight belt and is taking on former Bellator fighter Ricky Bandejas. Impa Kasangana is also on the card, his opponent is 9-1 and, and anytime you have the three syllables Magomed in your name you're usually a very dangerous fighter. And Daryl Horcher is also on the card. He's a guy who fought Habib on 9 days notice so pretty ballsy individual there. Kyoji Horiguchi moves up three spots in the Bellator Bantamweight rankings after the people doing the rankings received a lot of criticism for ranking him so low before. Above him are Magomed Magomedov, Rafian Stotts, Patchy Mix, Juan Archuleta, and the champion Sergio Pettis. Jillian Robertson versus JJ Aldridge on March 12th. Jillian has the most finishes in flyweight history with six, the most subs in USC women's history with five, even more than Ronda Rousey who had three. Mahachev is too big of a favorite for it to make sense to bet on him this weekend, but betting on him winning by submission at minus 110 odds makes a lot more sense. His last three wins have been by submission. All three of them were different subs and all three of them came in different rounds. One, three, and four. So he can tap you out early or choke you out late. So 25 minutes should be enough time for him to tap out green, win some green, and take home that 160 pound title.